god, oh my god, I'm so young to be dealing with such adult stuff. I texted my mom, I'm like, Mama, I think I'm dying. I feel like crying. I've been literally catching hands the entire week. I need a break. Besties, yo. <laughs> What's good besties? It is a girl Chantal here back again with another little video. So I'm not gonna do my usual intro because I'm pretty sure you can tell from my voice. I am down bad, down horrendous. Initially I wasn't going to <laughs> Okay. Initially I wasn't going to um full review, but a bestie sent me a message on Instagram and they were like, Hey bestie, we are waiting for a vlog. To be quite honest. I do have a vlog that I need to edit and there is a vlog that I wanted to film which is this one but I felt terribly ill Monday afternoon so I was ill last week and then I got better and then it started all over again on Monday so I am done bad, done horrendous, down I need a, I need a blow my nose, hold on saying that I've been down horrendous, down bad, I have allergies but to me it seems like it's, escal it's escalating to something more drastic so i need to try and book an appointment with the school's clinic because one thing about me i'm going to utilize all my resources okay and then my place is clean for the most part it's as clean as it can get for someone who's sick but no let me not even lie my place is clean okay i just need to tidy up and do little minimalistic stuff the biggest thing that i need to do is my laundry okay because i haven't done my laundry in a while so last week I was at home and that was all good and stuff. I took some of my laundry home, so I did that laundry. But I need to do my laundry, girl. Okay, I'm telling you, my duvet covers need to be washed. My duvet needs to be washed. My bedding, like my blankets. Oh God, I have so many things to do. I cannot afford to be sick right now. I have an entire debate on Friday, and I don't think I can even hear myself. How are they gonna hear me? But. Um, I have a whole lot of updates, so I don't want this to be like a traditional vlog. I want it to be are my lips oh, Come on I was saying that I don't want this to be a traditional vlog I mostly want it to be more of a digital diary so that it's not too much for me to edit because can y'all see the state of my nose right now? Child is blocked. I can't even breathe properly this morning. I woke up with a terribly sore throat like it was so painful I texted my mom. I'm like mama. I think I'm dying and to make matters worse I'm losing weight. So I was sick about a month ago and I lost so much weight from that. People couldn't see it. Like, the people around me couldn't see it. But I started noticing it with my clothes. Like, y'all know those um, crop tops that I bought last year for winter, the long-sleeved ones? They used to be tight, guys. When I tell you my crop tops are baggy, it's concerning. So, I just want to get myself together. I'm not rushing myself. I'm not attending any classes this week because those lecture halls are not cleaned properly and the dust will just make me worse so i'm like you know what let me just give myself time to recover let me not strain myself up I'm, 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 uh. i am of course doing my assignments and only going to campus when i have tests to write so yeah that's literally all to think about it i actually became worse <coughs> monday after my test there's something about those lecture halls that needs to be investigated because this is not the first time it's happening but the second time ah, screaming and it's for the same module oh my god it's for the same module i need to investigate that but anyways right now i'm just chilling i'm watching youtube videos but i have the energy to edit so i think that's exactly what i'm gonna do i'm trying to pace myself i'm not rushing myself at all i'm doing what i feel like doing i'll probably also make some lunch a little bit later i don't know what to eat i want bread but i don't have the energy to go to the shops like i'm really craving bread do you go to the shops or not side eye but yeah that's just that's just me right now i'm on a roll baby okay i feel a bit better like it's 16 minutes to one i feel a lot more better than what, how i felt in the morning and i think that's because of the pulls that i took and shout out to my friends and everyone in my life because they've been making sure that your girl is good okay i appreciate y'all for that i know y'all want you okay period <laughs> but yeah let me just get on with my day i don't really have anything planned and i feel like i've been saying the same thing over and over again so i'm just going to end this clip right over here this box has been sitting here for maybe a month guys and this is my furniture box now i have the other one over here 
and I'm going to tell you one thing this one specifically is pissing me off okay I'm not throwing this box away the dinner set box I should probably take this home because when I move out of here I need somewhere to put my dinner set so that's why I don't want to throw this away but the reason why this specific box hasn't been thrown out is because my shelves are not built y'all see these holes over here I need to make them um, deeper but I don't have a drill or a power tool but I am sick of all of these boxes okay I'm going to flatten them out and they have to get out of here like this little situation cannot happen anymore I try by all means to eliminate as much clutter as I possibly can for my place although I'm not going to get it 100% perfect what i'm not going to get 100 percent correct but i will try like my space is so open and any little thing makes it look like it's cluttered this box right here pisses me off it's not aesthetically pleasing doesn't fit the vibe none whatsoever it's time for it to go i don't know where i'll put these shelves but all i do know is that i'm taking them home with me the next time i go home so i can find someone to build these shelves for me at home i don't know how i'm going to carry them back but a plan has to be made okay i'm starting to get blind well, yeah, I'm going to get blind and I will make a blind. So this is my outfit. I've got these socks that my mom got me. Got these pajama shorts and a vest. But yeah, she got to go. Oh, she got to go. That's so crazy. Okay, let me look for these screwdrivers because I don't know where they are. Where would they put them? Okay, if I was a screwdriver, where would I be? These are my shelves, complete and filled. But um, I wanted to add the handles. I don't know where I put them, so I'm just going to use it without handles. But oh my god, I'm so obsessed! Yes! I love to see it. Okay. I don't know why there's a gap over there. Okay, but we ain't going my be. Okay. Oh my god. Now you're sliding up. Okay, I'll try and tighten it a bit more. But these are my shelves. Complete. Book me out. I can build, okay? This... This is my desk currently. I think I like it. I'm no longer mad at the handles because I just remembered that my theme for my desk is black and white and the handles actually go so well. If I did something like gold, it would look snaps. Unfortunately, my books don't fit, don't fit in any of the shelves and the shelves are a bit hard to move, but I think I should try and find a hammer so I can beat the thingies that are holding the shelves together. Um, a bit more so that it can fit properly but to be quite honest with you I'm so obsessed with how my desk is currently looking like I also got coasters from home they're like bird coasters they came in a pack of six of which if I'm being 100% honest I'm going to spray paints black and I'm also getting a black and gold um, bottle for my desktop that's just my uh, wind jar like every single thing that happens to me and that is a good thing I put it in that jar I am probably going to have some touch of purple because as you can see the, the um, jar has purple I don't know I'm still figuring it out but right now at the current moment I love it oh by the way my books 
I'm going to find a black book holder so I can put them over there in like a book holder or just find a black um, shelf hold on y'all I'll just find a black shelf which I'll put underneath the shelves like just a black shelf that's a bit big I don't know if you guys know the storage shelves these taxes are pissing me off okay but this is what everything currently looks like I'm proud of myself we did a great job we did a good job okay period oh I also need to do something about this extension cords oh my gosh there's so many things I need to update you guys on look at this look at this Guys, it hasn't even been a month. Look at this. I don't know how that happened. It's pissing me off. I have a feeling that this um, wood is not the best material because it also has these in my kashas, and I don't know where these kashas come from. Like it pissed me off so much when I saw it because I tried so much not to put any bottles or cups on the desk, but I still have these like little weird things. But hopefully, it's not too much of a big deal. I don't have any sheet and I'm feeling very, very low. Let me tell you guys a situation. A little dilemma. So, when I went home, I got chicken from my mom's fridge because if there's anything about me, I'm the last one and I'm definitely going to lose the groceries. So, I got chicken and it was so frozen. I got to my place, it was still frozen. I put it in the fridge. Yesterday, I don't know what I was looking for in the deep freezer, and boom, my chicken is unfrozen. So, I have to cook all of this chicken today otherwise it's not going to be eatable anymore so i had an idea and i asked my mom if it's okay and if i can do that and she said yes so i'm just going to boil the meat basically i'm going to pre-cook um, pre it and i'm going to ask my friend oh, my lovely friend Yasana, to um if i can store my meat in her fridge because i'm definitely not going to how many pieces of this three four five six seven eight eight pieces of chicken that's so much meat guys like i don't like meat but yeah with that being said, I need a new fridge. Like, there's literally nothing that will make me happier than getting a new fridge at this point because this bar fridge nonsense. This bar fridge nonsense is definitely not working out. If you can, if you, oh my gosh, if you can and if you have the financial means to, don't get a bar fridge. Rather, get a proper, proper fridge. And the thing with me, I want a fridge with a water dispenser. Don't ask me why I want a fridge with a water dispenser while I'm still a student. I just want one, okay? And I'm going to get it. But yeah. I just need to wash this meat first. Watch away all my dishes. I'll use this one. It's just as good as so it So this is my lunch. Honestly, it is not the most appetizing to look at. Like I need to learn how to plate my food better. But when I tell you this thing tastes so good, it has chicken, it has macaroni, it has some sauces, it's so good. And then I'm having it with just a simple diluted juice. Oh my god, these taxis. But yeah, this is what I'm having. Just for now. I think it'll be okay to fill me up until dinner time. I just came back to the place. I'm gonna walk in here. It smells like a hospital. What? It smells like a literal hospital, you guys. I'm not even kidding. I wish I was making all of this up, but I don't like the way it smells in here. Because, oh. Okay, hold on. Let's get the real light. Anyways, as I was saying, it smells like a literal hospital in here. But to be quite honest with you, I can't even blame my place because. The amount of medication that's on my counter right now, like, child, is getting a little crazy. And my friend gave me some pills to help with my sore throat. So, yeah, I'm just gonna put these in a toilet sheet bag. I'm tired of seeing them out. Yeah, they remind me that I'm crazy. I'm not crazy. What? I ain't crazy, girl. What? Why would I say that? They remind me that I'm sick and I don't need any more reminders, girl. I have enough of reminders. I don't need any more. So much medication. Oh my god, and I'm still going. Okay. Look, look at this. This is actually crazy. Look at this. Look at this. That's crazy. 
crazy things, man, crazy things. <laughs> so I like, listen, I'm the perfume girl, okay? I've been looking for perfumes that match my vibe and everything. So in the same breath, I've been looking for things that will make my house more good because I also want my house to be cute as well and good, okay? So I picked this up from my boss. <laughs> I picked this up from my mom. She bought it and it says body mist, but this does not smell like a body mist. It's from Wheelies. It's called the Cape Snow Bush Scent Souvenirs Body Mist. Child, this is the perfect room spray. Like, it's so fresh. I think I'll take a picture of it instead. It's so fresh. It smells so good. However, it doesn't stick. And it says it's worth 50. I'm so surprised. Why is it so expensive? But it doesn't stick. And then for my bathroom, I like using this one, the Gardenia one. But I, like, I keep it here. Because if you remember, this was my room spray last year for my first year room. So I keep it here because it looks really aesthetically pleasing over here. I like the spray for the bathroom. It literally smells like a bathroom spray. And I did say this last year when I got the spray, yes. I also like using this one from Glade. It's uh, air freshener. It smells like the bathroom, okay? This is a bathroom scent. But I don't like using it too much because I don't like that bathroom scent. Like it's just, yeah, it's not for me. Another spray that I like using is this one. So here is a concoction of water and fabric soft like shower. Well, I tell you this thing sticks, but you need to put a little bit. Actually, you don't even need to. You can put a little bit more fabric softener, but you don't need to. I love this, but I can't use this right now because it's too strong for me and it will trigger my sinus is so bad. And my sinus is already triggered. But this, oh my god, it's an OG. I can spray it on and I will still smell the fabric softener three days later. Even if I leave my windows open for three days, it's char, I will still smell that thing, okay? But I just wanted to push you guys on to that. Um, I've been thinking about buying perfume. I've been thinking about buying perfumes like body perfumes and I have bought y'all know the little plug the plug where everyone's getting um, designer perfumes uh, for a low price I've bought perfumes like sample size perfumes from them and I like two out of the three that I got so I'm just going to buy a bit more but I want that to be like either in an entire separate vlog or it's going to be a dedicated video because I have a lot of things to say about perfumes and smelling good i've been on this journey of like trying to tap into my feminine era so things like wearing perfume wearing earrings uh getting my nails done making sure that i look good my hair done like things that make me feel like a feminine girl i've been just doing doing it okay so yeah i have a lot of tea to share about that but I think I want to close off this video right here because I don't have anything else to show you guys. I thought I was going to do my laundry, but like I said, the smell of fabric softener and washing washing powder will literally trigger my sinuses and they're very really triggered. So I'm definitely not making it to the laundry room. I'll probably do my laundry tomorrow. I'll try to wake up early so I can do it in the morning. But yeah, that is, a, that is me for the day. Oh my god, there's still medication on my counter! Guys, I know I closed the video off, but I started washing my dishes and please look at this. I can fix it. I can put it back. It'll work. Like, look, it's simple. All I have to do is pop it on and screw this thing. But let me show you why. <laughs> I feel like crying. I've been literally catching hands the entire week. I need a break. Oh my God. Okay, let me show you. Please, let, can you see why? Can you guys see why I am not interested in oh god look at this can you guys see this hold on it's not focusing yeah can you guys see this can you guys see how dirty this is oh my god no like i need this replaced right now what is this this is just so nasty to me because my water passes there and that's where i get my drinking I'm going to start drinking bottles of water because this, 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 this cannot. You know what, man? I just thought about something. You know when we move to a certain place and then we are like, oh yeah, the water from that place doesn't lie with me. Maybe it's not the water. Maybe it's the taps. 
Oh my god, I'm so young to be dealing with such adult stuff. Now I have to go to the leasing office. I tell them because baby girl, I can't do this. Because if I file a report, it's gonna take like a week at least. Of course it's Wednesday today. They're gonna come next week, Thursday or something like that. Okay, maybe not manifest it, maybe they'll come on Monday. But what the fuck is this? I can't do this. How am I supposed to wash my dishes? Excuse my face. But how am I supposed to I'm taking a nap? I've been catching hands the entire week. I need to take a nap. I'm tired. Every other night another movie can make 